you know, you're stretching it. I, I, I've never heard anyone say, oh, women were always supposed to be included. In fact, that's what the scripture says. I think they know that they're, they're stretching it. Yeah. Well, what do you think about that? That doesn't bother me, because I think that, uh, <clears throat> that men need uh, rituals to do just amongst themselves, and that if you start counting women in a minion, men are just going to start going to strip clubs or where they can just be with other men. Right. So I think there's a real need for men to just be alone with men and do, do their own unique thing. Uh, and so if you don't give them that in religion, they're going to go right. you know, to sporting events or whatever right. they need to do to be alone with other men. I think that's true, but women need the same thing. I mean, women need to be alone with other women. Right, but I think that happens naturally. Because men aren't always trying to push themselves into places where women are aligned with other women. It's only the other way around. Women try to push themselves into places where men are aligned with men. But men don't, don't ever try to get, oh, I really want to be part of the kindergarten club. or Right. You know, we're not pushing to be part yeah. of the knitting club. Or That's true. We don't do that. Huh. That's really interesting. Is that? I mean, I think that's. I think that's probably true. Except men do manage to be. I mean, we do make our strip clubs and our sporting events. I mean, we do create those spaces in which. Yeah, we definitely want to create all male uh, spaces. Right. Right. Huh. Right. Women want to be with men, and men want to be with men. Well, women. Well, no, but women also. I mean, women also want their. Their time without men. I mean, they do. Right, but no man's but, trying to. Which is way in there. Like, I want to be part of your knitting club. Right. No. No, that's really, that's true. Well. Because you guys use the knitting club to advance, you know, a greater socioeconomic agenda. Right, right. Which I feel <laughs> excluded. Right. Uh, well, that, yeah, yes. That's, uh, I can't really argue with you. I mean, I will say that if, if there are uh, attractive and available women in that all women space, then men would be eager to get in there, but probably not if they had to sit through the knitting. So, yeah. Huh. Well, I'll have to think about that. I think that you may be right. And then that makes sense why you'd have to enforce the... Yeah. Hmm. Okay, what's the next thing that grabs you in our holy um, text? Well, that's the that brings us actually to the end of it. I, I don't... Okay, um, yeah. yeah, that's the end. That's the end. Okay, that's all, folks. <laughs> We're tired. Poor Joey here is sweating <laughs> out I, the I need to, to hydrate again. But <laughs> Joey needs thank to hydrate. Sorry for the... Uh, for the, the <laughs> Look at this man. Uh, yeah. I told man. you, Luke makes me nervous, and, and uh, he's very unnerving. If, if you haven't had a chance to spend time alone with Luke, you would be sweating too, I assure you. And, and um, sorry that the sound didn't work. We'll get it, we'll get it next time.